Hey guys, ECRG here, and today we're going to be talking about the most important skill for the modern day worker. Hey guys, ECRG here, and today I want to talk about the most important skill for the modern day worker. Now this applies to clinical research, applies to anything and everything, uh, basically any job nowadays. And I want to do a video because I think a lot of people took this class for granted when they were learning it back in middle school, maybe early high school. But practically kids are coming out the womb with this skill now just because it's that important to know how to do this. You need it for anything and everything. Kids need it now just to take a test. Even just like a pop quiz, you need to know how to do this skill. So are you guys ready for the skill? Go ahead and let the drum roll. Typing. Now you're probably thinking, that skill, that's like not even a skill. Like we took one class, blah, blah, blah. I don't want to hear it. This is the most important skill for the modern day worker. Think about how much time we spend on a computer nowadays at work. I literally go to work, I'm in project management side, and my whole entire job is predicated around the computer. My computer is the sole, uh, I guess, the sole center of my job. If there is no computer, I could not do my job without question. So I don't even know how people did this role back in the day. But it's so important. Typing is so important. If you are very slow or don't know how to type without looking, you are seriously slowing down uh, the work. You are seriously slowing down the workflow and you are a uh, rate limiting step in the process if you don't know how to type correctly or very quickly. I mean, the amount of emails we send, the amount of instant messages we send, the amount of uh, newsletters that we make, the amount of you know anything and everything, it all revolves around typing. Just doing a quick Google search, you gotta know how to type. And if you're sitting there hunting and pecking, then it just takes a lot longer to get things done and that time built over over days, months, weeks, just precious time that's being wasted. So typing is the most important skill for the modern day. And say thank you to your computer apps teacher back in the day or whoever taught you typing because who knew that it'd be this important. I think even when I was a kid growing up learning typing, I never, I knew it was important to learn, but I never felt like my life was predicated on learning it. You know, they never focused it as much as they did for like a history class or an English class. I wonder why that is. They, they, it was just one little class. You took it, you passed it. It was like one of those things you had to take, but it was never really focused on in depth. And it was just kind of a back burner class. And it, just to think like that is the most important class. Cause think about all the stuff you learned and you've forgotten from, from your undergrad from yeah even your undergrad um high school and middle school elementary school think about all that crap they spent so much time for you to learn and understand but you end up forgetting but typing we use every single day and we're talking just work right now we're not talking about personal use of the computer because i know we all spend a lot of time on the computer as well personally so yeah, just take this time, say thank you for that computer apps teacher who taught you typing or whoever taught you typing. I remember they had, all, back in the 90s, this was the 90s, they had all those computer games to teach you typing. Um, I forget the names of them, but they had a, a lot of courses you could take and little they had a little uh, CD-ROM discs that you put in the computer to play and you practice typing on it. And so I don't know if they still have those today. I'm sure they do but typing, one of the most important skills for the modern day. And I'm curious if anybody's a teacher listening to this or knows about it, I'm curious at what age they te teach typing now because I think I took typing in late middle school, probably like seventh, eighth grade. I, I imagine they're probably teaching typing, what, like second grade now or third grade? Like they gotta be teaching it early because I know my sister was in middle school and she was taking all her tests on the computer at that point at her school. So I'm curious. So comment down below if you know about that. Comment if you agree. Is this the most important skill 
that was that's not really focused on but should have should be given a lot more respect in the learning community because we use it every day every job uses it you know how to do it for every single job there's not a job in the modern era that is going to have any sense of longevity that doesn't require you to know how to type i'm sorry and if you can name one i challenge you in the comments to name one that doesn't require any computer interaction so that's going to be a challenge um, and I'm also realizing as the recording of this, this technology is moving so fast, this could literally change in the next few years, just the way voices coming online, people, I mean, just like I set my alarm at night to wake up using voice. I don't type in my alarm name or set the alarm. I just ask Siri to set an alarm for me in the morning. Um, I ask Siri to write reminders for me. So. You know, with AI and voice integration, you know, you've got Amazon Alexa, you've got the Google one, whatever Google's is called, Google Assistant, and then you've got Apple Siri. The way these things are getting better and better every year, you know, a lot more of the typing that we typically do could be gone into voice, which speed is the ultimate arbitrage. It's a lot faster to say something. You can get a lot more information across over the phone than you can typing it out. And you can say a lot more just by type by uh, speaking it than you can typing, and it happens a lot faster. So, speed wins. Speed is the ultimate arbitrage. So, literally, in a year or a couple of years, the the skill set is going to change. You're going to have to know how to talk to a, a robot. That's going to be the new skill, and that could be the most important skill. And they teach that from early on. Well, I'm sure kids then are going to be basically born with electronic devices. So they'll be learning to do that from a very young age but yeah comment if you agree down below thank you guys for listening to this video just wanted to give a shout out for the most underrated skill of all time but everyone uses it and comment down below if you agree once again email us at elite clinical group at gmail.com if you have any uh, questions concerns want to do business together network etc all right, guys, take care.